Hello everybody. So in this small video I will show you what happens when you burn out 3D printed resins in your furnace. Why should you do that? Because if you want to create jewelry uh, you will have to use a castable resin and yeah, as the word says you're gonna invest it in an investment material and afterwards burn it out and then cast something into the muffle. And to show you what happens without investing it, I'm going to start a series of films. And this is just a small little intro film. I recorded it ha one and a half years ago. And I never, I never uploaded it to YouTube because afterwards, in the next videos, I will also show you how to invest in the muffle system that I have. And I, I tried to cast. And I, I got electrocuted twice because the furnace, you will see it in the film, uh, it was of a very bad quality. It was not properly grounded, but it happened only when it was up to heat, not uh, the lower temperatures. So you, when you see me putting in uh, the sample or taking out something, nothing happened at that uh, time, but later when I put in the muffle and it stayed on temperature 850 degrees for a while, I got electrocuted. I didn't want to touch that furnace anymore. And uh, I was a bit demotivated afterwards and I had some health issues. So I just picked it up recently. And this is just like a small intro for you. If you are interested, maybe you come back and uh, hopefully I will already have uploaded the next video very quickly. Okay, so enjoy. So here we are in front of my preheating furnace. You see the temperature is rising. And um, I've put a sample inside here. This is the castable resin. And it's on a platen fall, so we can really de determine if it burns out without ashes or not. Uh, in a moment I will switch on the suction here that I have done on the floor because this is process is going to stink a lot. Later I'm going to check it again and it will burn and then in the end it will disappear. So we're at almost 200 degrees. So we have to wait a little moment. So as you can see it starts curling up it already starts uh, stinking. Oops, there we go. As you can see here, yeah. So it starts curling up. Okay, so, so at, at 300 degrees, let me see what happened. Here it's burning, as you can see. It puffed. Now it's burning. So let's see. What it does now. Should put on the light here so we can see it's not better. So you see it's it's uh, burned. So at the moment we are it's uh, 635 and when we look inside as you can see the it's almost gone yeah so it's it takes a while but it seems to be vanishing totally so the furnace has 750 degrees plus minus a few little back and forth I see here so <clears throat> I will check what it looks like now let me see I'll take out this here and then let's take a look. Uh, you see the foil is clear. There's no residue left. 